good, YouTube? It's your boy, AC Cooler, aka Big AC, back again with yet another banger for y'all, man. Now, as always, you know I stay with some straight heat for y'all, man. I always gotta make sure I keep them fire reviews for y'all coming. And today, I got another fire review for y'all, another collab shoot. You seen the review I did on the uh, the black and purple pair already last week. So now I got the, you know, the white and purple pair. If you know the shoe is I'm talking about, it's the Ama Manier Jordan 12. Same deal with the other ones, man. Same kind of little slide up packaging. Same, you know, nothing, nothing really different about it. You know what I'm saying? Same size tag, you know, same box. And the size tag does read Women's Air Jordan 12 Retro SP White Black Burgundy Crush. So it's like the reverse pair of the other one, which came out, you know, the other week. Well, they both came out at the same time, but you get what I'm trying to say. But enough about the box. We already know how the details of the box is, but just for, you know, good measures. Show y'all one more time, man. You know that nice little flu game detail they got inside there. Nice little, you know, nice little touch to the shoe if I might add. But let's get into it though. Now these, these different. I ain't gonna lie to you, man. These in hand, way different. Like the black and you know the black and burgundy pair is, is still top tier, but this one, the materials and details on these, of course, is the same. Like you know. Color block is just like a different, you know, white. It's that reverse nose is white instead of black. And the the suede on this pair, though, man, I don't know if y'all can see it on camera, but the suede on this pair, man, is buttery, man. Like the suede in the black pair, are cool, but this one is ten times softer in my opinion than on the uh on the uh, on this pair than on the black pair, man. Like it's a, it's a different feel to it. The leather itself is not no crazy crazy soft leather, but it's still a, a decent grade of leather. And of course you got, you know, wax white laces on this pair as well, if y'all can see that, that wax look on it. Then of course you got your typical, you know, your little quilted sock liner, which is so dope in my opinion. I love when All Mama there does this, man. I love that they give us this, this premium look. Like, All Mama there always does like this luxurious look for their shoes. And me personally, I'm a major fan of this pair. This one, I do see it getting dirty pretty fast, and I did hear some things about like the suede could bleed on the actual white part of the shoe, so. Make sure y'all get these shoes, man. I get some shoe protector. You know, I'm not, I don't really have no shoe net. I don't know which shoe brand is like the top tier brand to use for cleaning shoes or like protecting your shoes. But whatever brand you use, make sure y'all get it on these shoes, man, because I can see these getting dirty real fast. QC issues, I don't see too many QC issues on this pair, but overall, man, it's, it's a beautiful sneaker night. Now, you know, of course, you get your typical hang tag, except for being, uh, I think it was like a purple color on the black pair. It's an all white, you know, hang tag. Which, you know, it's, it's dope in my opinion. Nice little difference. Nice little subtle difference they do on this pair. But overall, man, this, between this and a black pair, man, it's, it's tough. It's tough to choose one that's a better sneaker. Because I do like these a lot. And I also like the black pair a lot as well. But this pair, I don't know, man. Like, the, the details in these is nuts, man. Like, I like that leather. I'm, me, personally, I, I do like Nubuck, you know, a lot. But this leather, you know, it makes the shoe look, I, I don't know, man. It's, it just looks better, man. I, at first, I was skeptical about it. I didn't think the white pair looked that good, but then got in my hand, man. Like, let me get y'all another look at this. This look at this suede, man. This that's crazy, bro. Like, this suede is beautiful, man. Like, top tier in my opinion. Beautiful sneaker. You know, you got the the little plated jump man right there, little shiny plated jump man on there. So, overall, man, what I what I say this is better than the black pair, man. Y'all let me know. You think this pair is better? You think the black pair is better? Matter of fact, let me get y'all like a look. A good side by side comparison of these so y'all can see which one of y'all opinion which one looks better the black or the white you know it's, it's tough man because both of them both of them some beautiful sneakers man but which one really like in my opinion the suede on the white pair like i said it's a lot softer than on the black pair but overall they both got soft suede the new book on this one the actual new book i like that as well Kind of gives you like that uh, 09 flu game vibe. You gotta remember that that pair that came out in 09, like the little sick face on the tongue, you know, like the little sick emoji. Before emojis were emojis, you know, you had it on the flu game pair. This is kind of like a cherry, you know, in my opinion. Even though the box does have like the little flu game aesthetic on the box, but the white pair kind of gave me like that cherry vibe, and the black pair gave me that, you know, 
flu game vibe, which is dope in my opinion. I like how they did. They paid like a little homage to the older colorways, the older OG colorways. And I am glad we're getting them cherries back again this year too. So I will be getting up here. But man, you know, once again, man, y'all let me know down below. Are y'all rocking with the white pair? You know what I'm saying? The, the details on these, personally, I feel like the white hits harder with like the, the color blocking on this, like even with the, the white, you know, outsole and the carbon fiber prints on the bottom of the shoe as well, the white jump, man. Just, I don't know, I feel like this is more of like a luxurious look. You know what I'm saying? With the leather and the suede, just how they blend perfect together, like the colorway and everything. It's my personal opinion. I feel like the white pair might be, you know, superior to the black pair. But overall, they both beautiful sneakers. I'm, I'm gonna rock both of them, you know, a lot of times, especially like, you know, in the summertime, I can pull more fits out of my opinion. But once again, man, y'all let me know down below how y'all feel about this pair, how y'all feel about this colorway, if y'all, you know, went for them, if y'all passed on them. You know, y'all let me know. I also got a couple of small other couple of details on these, man. Like the, you know, I did show y'all that on the black pair. You got the plated I'm Mom and Their logo right there. And then on the right pair, you know what I'm saying? You got the plated Jumpman on the tongue, which is, you know what I'm saying? Nice little difference than, you know, your typical, like, Jumpman to be on a, on a regular Jordan 12. But overall, man, beautiful sneaker. One of my favorites so far this year. Well, you know, the colorway wise and. I love our mom and their collabs. I got the, the threes, the fours, both twelves. Gotta get the ones and the twos, and then when the fives come out, of course I gotta get the fives as well. But as always, man, I appreciate y'all for watching my videos. Tuning into my channel, man. You know what I'm saying? Y'all getting my views up, my likes up, my my everything up, subscribers, all that good stuff, man. Make sure y'all smash the subscribe button too, man. You know what I'm saying? It really helps me out. I really appreciate when y'all subscribe to my channel. So y'all support me, you know, because I support y'all for supporting me. So, you know what I'm saying? We helping each other out, man. I'm getting y'all these good reviews. I'm trying to get y'all more early pairs in for, for y'all as well. So, stay on the lookout for that. Stay on the lookout for some up and coming, you know, changes to this channel in the upcoming months. So, a lot of stuff that the change this year in 2023 from hit the ground hard, man. Hit it, hit it rolling, man. You know what I'm saying? So, as always, man, I appreciate y'all for tuning into my videos and watching my channel. You know what I'm saying? Tuning into me. And I'm going to catch y'all in the next one, man. Peace.